Hey there, Leo. How are you? How's the family? Hope everybody's doing all right. We're going to get into a general spread here. Take it if it fits your situation. Leave it if it doesn't. You might have to vice versa the rules. Cross watchers are welcome as long as you have good intentions. We're going to start with the sacred destiny here. Let's go ahead and jump right on in for Leo. Please and thank you. For Leo, what have we got, Spirit? What have we got for Leo? Please and thank you. What's up, guys? You don't want to talk? Is something taking forever to get here? There we are. Let's see. We have going forward. Going forward to abundance. That's always a good sign right there. And at the bottom of the deck, we had action. So you guys are taking action to go towards some um, pretty serious abundance, it looks like. Some of you guys might also just be getting out of the house here, needing to get out of the house, going for a little road trip, vacation, get out of town maybe for some of you, go visit somebody or a location. This definitely has a country and earthy feel to it. Out in nature, any kind of nature. Let's see. Energy oracles. What's the energy surrounding Leo? Please and thank you. Energy surrounding Leo. We have, yeah, journey. Look, some of you guys are definitely going to be traveling here in the near future because you need to get out of the house. This could even be vacationing elsewhere, like across seas. There's definitely a trip. Guys, um, I feel like have your passports ready. Get your, you know, your license and everything in order. Um or not your license, but whatever, you know what I mean. Get your stuff ready because there might be a trip coming up in the near future. And I'd hate to see somebody offer you a trip or like an opportunity like this arise and then you didn't have all your stuff in time. Like, you know, your passport and enhanced driver's license and whatever it is that you need here to do this. Yeah, we have hostilities with the high priestess. So it's like, instead of being upset that you missed out the opportunity because you weren't prepared, you're going to be glad that you thought ahead and you pre-planned. Like, she's got this journal, this planner here. You plan something ahead of time to avoid something. It's going to make you feel like, I knew it. I knew it. I'm so glad I did that. Like, that's what I'm getting right now with this high priestess energy. You also have archangels here helping you, making sure you stay on your path. We have man holding a heart here. Yeah, this could, like, fill your heart all the way. Like, oh, my gosh, yes. Door to spirit. Like, the do there's a door opening for you here. Let's see what else we get for Leo. Please and thank you. Um, you could also know that there's somebody that's going to be upset with you. Or maybe you feel you have this intuitive nudge that somebody's going to be really upset with you, jealous of you. Um, don't let that get to you. Just kind of be aware that that's what's going on. And it might not be specifically that you get to do this. It could just be that they wanted to do this too. Or why can't I? Dang it. Oh, right. They might not be necessarily jealous at you. It could just be the situation. Which is kind of the same thing, but it's not. There are people that will be jealous of you specifically because it's you, right? But then there's other people that are jealous because they wanted that, right? So we have cornucopia. 
Wow, I told you, it's filling you up all the way. One, one, one on the board. Yeah, somebody's jealous of your cornucopia here. Or some of you guys are really stressed about it. The thinking man. Yeah, you are definitely thinking with your intuition here, listening to your intuition. It's coming through very, very clearly. And there is one piece that's broken on this. You see how that one is broken right there? You know you're either about to lose someone or, um, yeah, it's strategy. It's almost like make sure you're prepared so you don't break a lucky streak. Like your, your intuition hasn't proved you wrong yet. It hasn't, it hasn't um, tripped you up yet. So don't start not listening to it now. Keep taking action. Keep, you know, keep hitting these abundance, these wins moving forward um, by strategy, uh, strategizing, really thinking it through, becoming very crystal clear before you take any actions. I do feel like some of you tend to think with your heart. Um, but right now we have somebody holding their heart and their thinking, right? So you're not just thinking with your heart. You're thinking with your head and your heart. And it looks like they're leading you to this cornucopia again because you let your intuition help you strategize step by step how this journey is going to go, how you're going to be showing up and moving, right? It really feels like a lucky streak, but because you pre-planned it, right? Luck is when preparation meets opportunity. That's exactly what you're reading as, too. Yep. Another archangel here, making sure you're rooted. It's like thinking down to the last detail, double-checking everything, making sure you got everything, you signed everything. We have contract, you paid for everything, you've uh, made your reservations, all of that. There's also really, really good karma here. Contract, this is uh, justice, right? Bringing in balance. Luck is when preparation meets opportunity. And you guys really, really made sure that you got all your steps here taken care of. I love it. Right on time. Um, let's throw some tarot on it. For Leo, please. And thank you. For Leo. Please and thank you. We have the Three of Cups. Yeah, this is going to be something we're celebrating. You're going to have so much fun. You could, have, uh, could even be meeting other people where you're going or traveling with others. Or like there's other people helping you here. I'm getting a little bit of teamwork with that three of cups. But it's also about celebration. Yep, three of coins, teamwork. Yes. And then also master number 33. So definitely teamwork. But there is a sense of mastery here. There's a sense of mastery here. Maybe you've mastered karma. And that's why you're on a lucky streak. Right? Even when you wanted to get hostile because things weren't going your way, you didn't. And now you're seeing all these blessings coming through because, like, the divine saw that. All the times you wanted to say something nasty or throw your hands up in the air and be like, you know what, I'll just, I'll just do it tomorrow. But instead, you knuckled down and you did it. And now it's like just payoff after payoff after payoff. That's so cool. All right. Anything else here? Yeah, you're not the only one that worked hard for this. The chariot. Yeah, major forward movement. Cancer energy. And then final card out. We have here the Ace of Swords. And that's Michael. Michael's sword. That's a hard yes. You are definitely moving forward and celebrating all this hard work. Show it off. Show it off. Some of you guys are going to have a car that shows all your hard work and efforts. Like, I don't know, it, maybe this trip, whatever it is, you're about to have so much fun.
the time of your life. <laughs> Lovers at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, it's a choice. It's always a choice. And there's that karmic energy. Hostilities. We have the Queen of Wands down here, right? So somebody is big mad, but whatever. You worked hard for this. That's also the queen of wands. You worked really hard. You stayed dedicated and focused and you did everything you needed to do. You ran around, took care of all your errands. Uh, you wrapped up all the loose ends. You're taking care of business, honey. Keep it going because it's, like I said, it's paying off. We have Gemini and Cancer, um, Aquarius, Cancer, Pisces, Aquarius, Pisces, uh, Gemini, and Libra on the board. Um, go ahead and come up with your questions, guys. I'm going to go ahead and give this four shuffles, and then I'm going to answer some of your questions, all right? Wow. Listen to your intuition. I can't even make it up, guys. One, two, three, and four. If you need more time, go ahead and pause. Answers for Leo, please and thank you. We have recovery. We have no. Be assertive. With that be assertive, I'm hearing it's not going to do it on its own or it's, you know, you got to do something here. It's not going to naturally happen. Like the laundry is not going to do itself, right? <laughs> Look for a sign. All right. For somebody else, we have romance. For somebody else, we have in the near future. Answers for Leo. Please and thank you. For somebody, we have forgiveness. And last card out, ask for help from others. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and leave it there. I hope this message helps somebody, and I will see you guys in the next one. Until then, stay beautiful.